What's going on, chicken friends? It's Donna Little from The Coop Scoop. If you're new to my channel, welcome, and if you're not, welcome back. The other day, I put a short out, and it was um, a painting that I did for my chicken coop, and one of my awesome subscribers asked if I could show you guys how I did it, and I thought, what a great idea. Yes, I would be happy to do that. Now, I'm gonna give you guys a, a couple of disclaimers before I get started on it. First of all, this isn't an original idea. I came across this years ago on um, online somewhere, and it was just one of those sort of tutorial pages showing you how to do easy uh, paintings of chickens. And they had several different styles, and I chose this one because I thought it was adorable. And I did um, one with watercolors, and it's in my chicken coop, and then I just did the one from the other day. Um, and I did it on a piece of plexiglass, and it is done with acrylic paint. Now, I'm not a painter. I don't know much of anything about painting. So if you wanna watch this because you are hoping to pick up some fantastic tips or techniques, I am not your girl. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm doing, but I can copy something easy. So that is what I've done. Um, it is super easy to do this. I, what I'm gonna do for the sake of time is probably just speed the video up because it'll probably take me about 30 minutes to do this. Um, and I'll just, you'll, you'll still get the gist of how I did it. Uh, also, I do not have good materials or tools to do this with. I have a set of paintbrushes that I've probably had seven or eight years that I bought at Walmart. So you can, you can get the idea that they are not quality. Uh, I also, because I don't do paintings, I am a little artsy. I do charcoal sketches. I don't have the proper paper. Um, this is, I don't know how well it's going to hold up when it gets wet. I would need um, like canvas paper to really do a good painting. So this is, uh, I'm going to do it on this paper and it's probably going to get a little warpy. I don't know. But um, I do charcoal sketches like this. Um, I did this one from a picture uh, that somebody took of my son on his boat and I gave it to him as a gift. And then I did this picture um, of my sister's adorable dog who has since passed away. It was the love of her life. And um, I gave this to her for her birthday. So I guess we're about to find out whether or not this paper holds up to getting wet. But uh, let's get started.
All right, here is our finished painting and it's absolutely adorable. The paper held up pretty well. It is a little bit curled up at the bottom and it's a tiny bit warped, but considering the fact that it wasn't really made for paint, it held up pretty well. Um, this did indeed take about 30 minutes to do, which is why I sped the video up, but you could see how really, really simple this was. I think any one of you, even with absolutely no experience painting a picture, could pull this off and probably do a better job of it than I did. So give it a try if you are so inclined. And I hope that you guys are enjoying our content and that you'll stick around and continue to support the channel and watch our adorable girls and all the crazy things that they do. And be also looking for our chicks that are gonna be here in June. How cute is that face? Guys, I hope you all have a fantastic day, and I will see you in the next video.